It was a day similar to this one last Friday. Come on, buddy. When Roy Ayers went out on the trails by his home in the Peaceful Valley neighborhood near Kendall and Whatcom County. Today, however, he's out here with his stepdaughter, Aaron Suda, looking for his wife. But the last time I saw her was right here. Roy says their dog, Smokey, ran away and he chased after him, never thinking his wife, Julie Montag Ayers, would wander away too far. I don't know if she went ahead and walked or if she came back this way to go home. It wasn't like the wrong thing to do, except afterwards. You know, I looked at it, of course it was the wrong thing to do. Surveillance video shows the couple, a few paces apart from each other, heading off to the trails. The family has this video thanks to neighbors, their community who wants to help bring Julie home. All day Saturday, probably 50 plus volunteers, friends and family, neighborhood volunteers came out. Signs of support are up at several places. At the local library, flyers with information on Julie, urging people to call 911 if they have a tip. And this sign outside the fire station has a simple message for those driving by. Bring Julie home. Here we go, Smoke. Aaron says even though her mom has dementia, there was no reason for the family to be worried. She's still very capable of navigating in the areas where she's most right. familiar. She has been lost before when she was still driving, and, and that was pretty scary. Yeah. Um, but we, we haven't lost her for a while. But with the history of getting lost, Aaron was thinking ahead. We'd been shopping trackers. I'd been thinking about and talking about put getting her a tracker, talking to her about getting her a piece of jewelry or something she could wear. That plan, however, never worked out. It felt a little bit challenging to find one that was going to work really well for her because she's someone that still considers, you know, considers herself very capable, doesn't think she needs people tracking her. Thanks for all your work. Despite the official ground search being suspended, the Whatcom County Sheriff's Office says it's still working this case. Julie's family plans to continue looking for her, leaning on their faith during this difficult time. She's in God's care and keeping. She's safe every step of the way, and she's going to be coming home. In Whatcom County, Cornelius Hawker, King 5 News.